Now, we're going into the tribe of Naphtali. Naphtali. Okay? Let's go to Genesis 49 and 21. And there's a mystery connected with this tribe too. And we're going to pull that out. All right? Some people have been teaching that Naphtali is Argentinian Chileans. Absolutely incorrect. We're going to teach the truth on that. Go to Genesis 49 and 21. Read that. Naphtali, behind let loose, he giveth goodly words. He giveth goodly words. Naphtali is the modern day Hawaiians and Samoans. Yes. They're from the tribe of Naphtali. The goodly words they give is when you go on their land, and I know because we went there, I've been to Hawaii, the goodly words they give you is aloha. They greet everyone that come down with ladies around their necks. Similar to what you see on this picture right here. The ladies around their head and around their neck, they give goodly words. They were taken down or being controlled by the Asians today. But they are also from the tribes of Israel, the Aborigines of Hawaii and Samoan. We're going to show you the mystery when it comes to that. Read that again. Naphtali is a hind let loose, he giveth goodly words. Go ahead. It says a hind let loose to let you know that they are wilderness people when it comes to how they interact with the land and how they dance and how free they are as a people, like a hind let loose. Very nice and friendly and great people. Let's go to Deuteronomy 33 and 23 because this is the mystery to show you who they are today. And I put something on the board to give you further understanding. But we're going to go to Deuteronomy 33. Right? And we're going to read the 23rd verse. About Nathali. Read. And of Nathali, he said, O Nathali, satisfy it with favor. Satisfy it with flavor. I mean, with, with favor. They got flavor, but I'm talking about with favor. To let you know that they're very good looking people. Go ahead. And full with the blessings of the Lord, possessest thou the west and the south. It says, possessest thou the west and the south. Now, those that used to break this down thought that the west and the south meant Argentina and Ch Chile from the west and South America. Incorrect. All right. When you go into the Hebrew, all right, and we're going to bring the Hebrew up. All right. We're going to bring that with my Hebrew book at, right here. We're going to bring the Hebrew up along with the Strong's Concordance. Do a little school here and let you know. I'm, let's go to my board here. Naphtali. When you see the south and the west, the word west is not really there in the Hebrew. The word seas is there in the Hebrew. So unless you go into the Hebrew, you would think it's in a different region. It's seas, which is yum, or bodies of water. The south and the sea. The South Pacific Seas is what? South Pacific. Who's in the South Pacific? Hawaiians, Samoans, and the Aborigines. How do you know that? Here it is right here in the Hebrew. I'm going to read it here. O Naphtali, and this is coming out of the Hebrew English Tanakh. All right? O Naphtali, say it with favor and full of the Lord's blessing, take possession of the west and the south. When you look at it right here, it's yum, wada, wada rawum, which is yum, which is waters, and this word right here is south, waters of the south, wada rawum. Bodies of water, and the south in the 23rd verse and when you go into the strongest concordance it's number that word west is number 32 i mean 82 20 
8220 of the Hebrew in that same place when you go to Deuteronomy 33 and 24 and it says yum a large body of water right here and I have it marked so that they can go over my finger is there on yum so the word west was put there west should not be there for Naphtali it's seas or bodies of water who's in the southern seas our brothers Naphtali, the Hawaiians and Samoans, yes, they are our people. They're from the tribe of Naphtali. Again, it shouldn't be south, possess the south and the west. It should be the south and the seas. What's that? On your map, South Pacific. Naphtali in the South Pacific. What people or Aborigines are in the South Pacific, the South Pacific before Japan and the Asians came over to control them, the way the Europeans are controlling the Indians here today and, and the, uh, the other tribes here today, Hawaiians were there already, they came over here in 718 BC. Samoans, and they're the Aborigines of these lands, Hawaii and Samoans. And there's a few other islands down there. You have Honolulu, a lot of those little islands down there. They're from the tribes of Israel. They're from the seed of Naphtali, their father. They give goodly words, oh, aloha. <laughs> and we're here to say aloha to you brothers and you sisters over in Hawaii. You were lost, but now you're found. <laughs>